And... Ooh, I want to go for this guy. This should be a one-shot, right? <laughs> that was a perfect shot. Absolutely. Fellas, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for hanging out today. So, in today's video is kind of a bittersweet one. I know, strange, right? You click on the KV2 video, you expect one shots, you expect high explosive, you expect memes and fun and 152 millimeter reload Jeopardy music stuff. It's not in today's video though. I didn't do it. However, the KV2 is kind of neutered in my opinion. This is with high explosive mainly. With volumetric and high explosive catching on anything, you know, let's say you try to aim here for a splashdown effect and it hits right here. Just a little bit, it's going to detonate right here. All right. Realistic. <laughs> and then high explosive has been low, low, low explosive. It's been lower. It doesn't shrapnel as much as you would think. Like this stuff penetrates and then it doesn't really do as much as you would really want it to. Now, sometimes it does. Sometimes it doesn't. It's really hit or miss. It's not that old school high explosive to where, hey, you're 93% chance you're going to blow up. And then I'm going to go have fun reloading for 33 seconds. Today, we're going to try to make it work to the best of our abilities and see if we can get some long range yeets, long range shots with the KV-2. And uh, by the way, Tigor's my uh, commander slash spotter for today's video. If you guys don't know what this is, this is a in-game decoration that you can put on your tank or vehicle and it will keep you company in your battles ahead. And it completely, absolutely, directly supports me. It's unbelievable how much that pack supports me. Uh, and then you also get the uh, million sub decal, the Tigor decorator or decoration, and then one in a fillion title. Thanks for the support, guys. Thanks for being here today. And let's go... Let's go get some long-range yeets. We're going to have to hope that the KV-2's armor can hold us up or can prevent the enemy's attack just for a little bit so we can get into a defilade. And I'll show you exactly where we need to go. Oh, Lord. Let's just send one over there to show him who's boss. Not a bad trajectory, honestly. Yeah, look at where it landed. Okay, so let's turn turret this way. Give him a little bit of angle to bounce off of. I think it's right about here where we, where we want to go. And we're, we're in, we've are we already achieved top speed here. Yeah, right here is really, really nice. Now over here. Just so we can, you know... Just lob these shells in there. Not have to worry about too much. Okay, straighten out. And, you know, once this settles down over... God, I thought it was an enemy tank. We can kind of push through here, too. Okay, you can see why I wanted to be here. Right here, nice. Okay, let's start range finding. 800 meters. And I'm just gonna fire a little bit higher than that. Hang on, let's wait. Oh my God. God. Okay, all right. Very good. 800 meters is dialed in pretty much perfectly. Let's look for our next target. Is that is that something right here? That might be a Stug. Yeah, I'm going to shoot at that. I'm going to shoot at that. Yeah, I'm going to shoot at that. Right here, but we have something in the way. We're going to have to aim a little bit to the left of it. Okay, it is a Stug. Let's aim up to the right, just like... Ooh, that might be a little bit too much. We'll see, though. Hey, we have another 15 seconds to um, contemplate. 
At least he's not moon anywhere. Still alive. Well, oh, we got we got another Panzer over there. And yes, let's go. Nope. A little bit up to the right. Yes, that's going to be the shot. That's going to be the shot. Stug, just stay there and be a good tank. Should have brought more ammunition. Usually, this is about as many shells I get off in an entire battle. The KV-2. Okay, almost ready. Everyone, wish me luck. Is he firing? Gosh. Don't move. Don't move. Oh, gosh. Late. Okay, a little bit to the left now. Okay, feel good about that shot. We got a, uh, another Panzer up. We got two. We got a Puma, too. And... Ooh, I want to go for this guy. This should be a one-shot, right? <laughs> that was a perfect shot. Absolutely. Now there's a puma that went that flew right by. I hope that my team got him. I don't really think they did though. I've seen a lot of bad kill feeds from the uh, from from a puma. Can we have danger close? We're gonna reset scope here. Don't really feel too safe here anymore. Oh my goodness, you really just gotta... You really just gotta hit them perfectly. I mean, I, yeah, I know it's a low shot, but this is high explosive. <laughs> Ooh, we got shot from the front. We're going to be in cover, I think. Ooh, wow, we weren't in cover. Okay, I'm going to see if I can push one of these guys. I to me. Is it a Puma? Ew. Don't worry, we're still okay. We got to wait for him to shoot. Okay, there he, sh there he goes. Okay, good, that works. Now we've got a very long reload. And unfortunate, yeah, unfortunate right there. Okay, I'm just gonna bean this. Hang on, we actually might get a range in here. I'm gonna go for like a thousand. Eight, 800, really? All right. <laughs> wow, right underneath them, beautiful. This is a sniper. The projectile goes so straight. Come on, guys. We got to push up. We got a Stug over here. We're going to try to range find him. 800 is 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 the way to go. Okay, let's go maybe for 750. No, I'm going to go for 800. On the way. Dude, that Stug is unbelievably survivable. We gotta get near Bravo. Like, that should be a kill shot. Nope, that, that Chaffee that we uh, hit his transmission is killing our team now, unfortunately. Alright, will you go away? Poor shot. Thought I would just hit him in the same location right there. We got a Sherman Panzer IV right there. Come on. Get him, boys. Yeah. Yeah, 
They're just better than us at uh, long range maps. Just gonna beam this Puma though. That'll make me feel good. Worth it. Dang, our team got smoked, dude. You would think that the Russians would push in, but I feel like we had more Americans than Russians this game. Yeah, it feels like that. So pretty positive, I gotta say. Last game, there were some shots that I would have liked to have go boom. Like that one in the chaff. You know, even though we shot the transmission, let's just be, you know, it's almost six kilograms of explosive mass, like yada, yada, yada. And the, uh, the Stug one would have been nice as well. But for, for the most part, everything I looked at that... I hit properly, went away. Especially the Flak 88 and the Pumas. That was the test there. Now, we did directly hit ammo on the Puma, but still. Okay, getting up close and personal on Alpha. I'm going to follow that Chaffee. I like where his mind's at. KV1 Bravo, no good, no good. We'll at least try just to take his cannon barrel out or something. Yeah, maybe you're right, but I'm not too comfy yet. Hey, Sherman. Okay, we're gonna have a little look-see here. Good hit. Sorry, buddy. Low C and tilt. We're gonna get all the way back in this cover. We're gonna use all the real estate we can here. Okay, we're reloaded. You see anybody, brother? Okay, no, we're clear. Let's move left. Okay, infiltrating from the rear. M24s are doing wonderful. is an R3 up too. Okay, we should see some enemies soon. Should see some enemies soon. Potential enemy here. Ooh. I'll never trust those things. Never. Oh, that guy got ripped. Like, like, let, let, Lord Thunder, let's just give me the benefit of the doubt that, like, that, that tank weapon system and everything's probably offline for a little bit. All right, round two. Okay, there we go. Okay, decap on A. Okay, good. Our team got melted, but they're they're, they're heading back, and we are, and we're going to Charlie and stuff. I mean, this one M24 is doing work though, so let's just keep positive here. All right, good. Cap on A. Maybe we should watch Main Road. Left side, we got someone out in the open. He's dead? No, he's still alive. Let's give him a track shot if we can. Beautiful. That's exactly how it's supposed to work. Okay, let's reload here. I might... Come on, Velcro. I might want to use this Panzer IV as some kind of just spaced armor here. 
Okay, M24 is dead. KB1B's back at A. Where do I even shoot this guy? Like, this is my shot right here. Oh, volumetric. I don't even think I can fit in there, even if I have a perfect shot. Okay, we gotta go below tank shot. I'm worried about that Panzer IV that killed the the Chaffee. But we gotta move quickish here. Is he fully repaired? Okay, more track. I don't think his tracks are 33 second repair times, but they could be. We need to get underneath that. Start the, the rotation to the right. Come on, Tigger, help me out here, brother. Someone just hit him? Okay, he's, he's starting to push around, I think. Oh, look at that. <laughs> look at that, dude. I can't do anything to this guy. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I mean, I was hoping that that shot underneath his turret would have gotten his engine, but... Nope. But the good thing is our, our, our team's doing good. Nice distraction. KV-1 set idle for a little bit. Couldn't do too much. There is an R3 in. So hopefully this M4 can get the KV-1 down a little bit. Please no Panzer 3, 4 right here. Okay, I think the M4 just took a KV-1B shot. Okay, he's to the left up here. Thank gosh, his barrel's out for a little bit. Nato, friendlies. Yes, Nato. Wonderful, dude. Okay. We have a R3 over in this direction. That's what I should have done the first time. I just... Please, don't push out yet. Oof. No, you turned too quick. All right, I'll take that. Okay, let's get the shot off proper. Come on, Artie. Okay, what's the pen on this backside on the Stug? It has to be a one shot. Ooh, there's stuff in the way, there's stuff in the way, there's stuff in the way. Beautiful. Okay, reload it. I'm, I'm kind of su- well, no, uh, not- Almost. Kind of surprised at how many times we've been able to reload this thing. Okay, enemy on Bravo, or Alpha. Here, moving to my right. Let's get a little more spacing. <laughs> 
Yeah. It's a lot of enemies here. This game's not over at all. Maybe one piece. Oh gosh, he's so quick. I I can't even face a KB one B. Is this over here or over here? Jesus. Thank gosh. Okay. That one worked. And that enemy tank behind me knows where I'm at. Let's try to move, I guess. We have to try to reload. Go get A. Go get A. Somehow. We no longer have the advantage. Attention to the designated grid zone. Dangerous, dangerous, dangerous. I don't know, I, I don't even know if that was the enemy or not. Okay, right in there. Yes, okay, good. It was just my poor shot earlier. Hey. Yes. Turn the barrel. Don't let him through. <laughs> that was okay. I had fun, but n not as much fun as I used to have in the KV-2. Like, back in the day, the KV-2 was loaded. It was like, okay, I'm reloaded. Who wants to get completely removed? And, and even the, the gun sound doesn't sound that impressive. And even the, ex like, the, I don't know. It's just, it's too tedious with too little reward and too much risk. It's just, it makes sense just to use a normal tank. Um, now, AP is probably a whole different story, but let's, come on. 152 millimeter HE, close range, like, things are going to go pop. But, in, uh, in, in War Thunder, no armor's best armor, and um, artillery tracks every time it's called in. Oh, and we have new close air support American planes coming in. Oh, and a new patch soon. So, j just forget about low tier and buy the new stuff. All right, guys, I'm Fly Daily. Have a great day. Peace out.